Hello everyone. Today we're going to be talking about Bill Clinton, Hunter Biden, and apparently their shared uh, attraction to uh, female minors. Yes. What I'm going to say is that um, I have reason to believe that the FBI currently has an open investigation into uh, pet, a, pedophil a uh, pedophilia case against Bill Clinton and Hunter Biden, and that those, those uh, cases are active right now. Now, let's deal with the easiest one right here uh an associate of bill clinton by the name of doug band apparently has made a deal with the fbi and he is testifying against bill clinton in the epstein investigation it would appear that mr clinton uh was with uh, mr epstein on four separate occasions on his private island and while there they engaged in sex with underage girls and he is willing to testify to that fact so there's the easy one now let's go to the next one the FBI is investigating Hunter Biden but the FBI hasn't said anything to anybody about what they're investigating him for now the Biden's contacts and allies in the media are stating that it's about his taxes they don't know that they just made that up they're telling us that to make it sound like it's not a big deal. They don't know what the FBI is investigating. But one of the agents apparently involved in the Hunter Biden case is this guy. He is recently deceased. He was an FBI agent that specializes, specializes in child pornography operations. And he was somehow involved with the Hunter Biden FBI case against, I mean, against Hunter Biden. So there's a hint there, okay? If this guy is, is, is specialty is child pornography and he's involved with the Hunter Biden investigation, that gives us an idea for what that investigation is about. Okay, and the word is kind of leaked out so that the media is starting to cover, try to cover this up by putting out false stories about how this guy was no way involved because he's in Miami, right? And the office looking out of it is out of Delaware. Uh, that's misleading this is their specialist he happens to be operating out of Miami this is a very big case he was involved he's a specialist the case is being headed up by that Delaware office but he was involved in the case because that's their top pedo guy and he's dead now just like that fellow is going to be these people are very powerful they're very dangerous i'm not talking about the clintons and the bidens i'm talking about the people that own them this is how they keep the politicians under control they compromise them and then we they blackmail them into doing their bidding 
once we destroy their network, they will lose their ability to control our governments. This is where the real fight is taking place, and we are winning. Expect good news by summer. And with that, have a nice evening.